All right, Mount Tuffers, welcome to day one of week four. You are making significant progress. I'm proud of you for getting this far. This is the last week of phase two before we go into some heavier stuff, but it's gonna flow exactly the same way as last week. Remember, we're only changing the routine every two weeks or so as we go through the program. So day one, again, is just like last week. We're doing some strength work. Don't forget your pre-workout pieces. We need the mountain tough warm up in there. Don't forget the band walks. You got that modified section of band walks coupled with the shoulder band work as well before you go into the workout. The workout is same as day one from last week. You're supersetting squats with flat bench. You're doing four sets of 10 reps. Use your ending point of last week as your starting point for this week. So make sure you logged it. You know where you finished those 10 reps at last week. This week, do the same thing for your first set. You got one or two left in the tank. Don't forget, up the weight before the next set. By set number three or four, you should be at failure as you finish off those reps. After the squats and flat bench, you're shifting to the front rack lunges. Super set with the incline bench. Again, four sets of 10. And don't forget, a minute and a half rest in between sets. So you do your front rack walking lunge, followed immediately by the incline bench, then you take a minute and a half rest before you go into your next set. That's two super sets down, one more to go. We're gonna change it up a little bit on you this week. It's not gonna be the suitcases this week, it's still gonna be core. You're going to do your skull crushers, like last time, 10 reps. But this time, what you're gonna do is you're gonna do a set of 10 skull crushers, followed immediately by a two minute front plank. Yes, you heard that right, and you're gonna like it. Then you're gonna go back to 10 skull crushers, and then you're gonna do a minute and a half front plank. Then we're gonna go to 10 skull crushers, and we're gonna do a one minute front plank. And then we'll close it out, and the 30 seconds is gonna seem easy after all that. You'll do 10 more skull crushers, and then 30 seconds of the front plank. And like I said, by the time you get to this stage in the front planks, you're like, ah, no sweat, 30 seconds? I can do that with no problem, especially after the two minutes of the front plank at the beginning. Have a great workout, Mountain Tuffers. Looking forward to seeing you tomorrow.